In this video, we're going to take a look at the Think tool, Remote Diagnostics and Think Link feature. So the Remote Diagnostic feature really brings independent garages the flexibility to repair and kind of program almost anything, plus an option to get technical support from trusted garages. There are a number of units from ThinkTool that are available with the remote diagnostics feature and today I'm using the uh, ThinkTool Euromax, also known as the S20 in uh, North America. So what we've got here on the top right corner is the remote diagnosis button. Now if we press that it opens up the remote diagnosis platform. So what we can see here is we've got a few options and we're going to just talk through what some of these features do. So on this page here, what we can do is publish an order to anyone. Let's say you wanted uh, some technical support, you could use the difficult consultation. We've got module replacement there. Um, refit might be for if you fit a new module that needs calibrations or if you've retrofitted a new uh, system to the car like a tow bar for example and then we've got uh, tyre pressures, anti-theft matching for things like immobilisers and also battery systems too. So what you would do is type in here what you would like support with then they can get back to you and discuss that request further. So if I hit that publish order button now, that will publish that ticket for all of the available users to see. The better way to go about this is to go to the business list. Now, this gives you the opportunity to actually build relationships with garages and maybe discuss your problem before you actually um, take on the services. So this would be a contract of service between you and the person at the other end. So all of these on here at the minute are garages. So in some cases they're specialists. So they are just the right people you need to get help with your specific brand of vehicle. Essentially what those people at the other end can do is use their um, branded diagnostic equipment. So for example, on this Audi, it would be Odis. They would use their Odis subscription to actually help you on your car without you having to go there. So what we've had to do is connect the VCI up to the ethernet cable, and then we've put the other end of the cable directly into the router. And um, the first time that you plug it in, uh, depending on which tool you've got and when you get it, you might have to update the VCI. So what it will do is download the new firmware to the VCI and it automatically does the update routine. You haven't got to do anything, just make sure it's not disturbed. So here we can see on this page here, we've got a few people available. So Autolec here, you can see that they've got some different brands there available. They've got a whole list as well on the front of their page there. So that's been uploaded onto their profile for the different types of um, problems they might be able to help you with. So what we can see here is that ThinkCar UK remote support is online because where it says normal business is in amber and the phone and the video icons are highlighted. So on this page here is where you basically conduct business with the uh, support agent. So what we can do here is, is type and send messages. So now we've sent a message over to them to see whether they can help us with our car. Uh, if we click the plus button here, we can basically send them a picture of the car. So, uh, well, you can send them a, a picture of, of anything really. So um, what this is useful for is say, if you've uh, replaced a new module and you need to send a barcode or part number or, or anything like that, you can send them images. Uh, we can also send them a diagnostic report. So I've not got a diagnostic report on here for this vehicle just yet, but they can also see your last 10 diagnostic reports. So, um, you know, you don't have to send them the report. They can already see it. What they can then also do is, is have a call with you, a video call or a voice call. And that's especially useful if you're having um, technical support or something like that. Um, it's important that you kind of stay um, with the unit because you might have to like turn the ignition off or turn the ignition on during programming and calibration routines. Another thing that's really good about this feature is that you can actually message the uh, support agent 
uh, before you do the job. So let's say you have a, a car booked in tomorrow or next week, you can get in touch with them, let them know when the car's arriving or the parts are arriving and actually book that job in so you're not waiting around for that job to be done. You've both got it in your diary. Just remember as well, these aren't people sat in an office, they're people sat in a workshop, you know, doing uh, jobs just like you. So it's good for both of you if you get that work booked in properly. If you want to take the guesswork out of diagnostics, then come and check out the Mechanic Mindset Diagnostic Coach Programme. We have a whole online training platform which is dedicated to making things easy to understand and can also be accessed on our brand new mobile phone app. Benefit from the instant access of over 15 training courses and counting on topics like electrical diagnostics, sensors, engine management and emission systems, CAN bus and networks and oscilloscope. We add new lessons every month. Plus, you can download certificates for completing certain courses. We have a monthly live training session, which we record if you can't make it, and a private community, which is willing to help you with your diagnostic problems. So sign up today for your first month free using the code YouTube, and I hope to see you at the next live training session. The price of the job is then agreed between you and the support agent, of course. Some jobs would um, have different levels of support, um, different manufacturer software has different prices per hour, so there's not one fixed uh, price. So let's see if Think Car UK here can help us with something. They've just messaged back now saying what do we need help with, um, and let's just see if they can activate something on the car, okay? So what they'll be doing is basically connecting to the vehicle. Okay, so in a moment they should hit the remote control button and show us the connection to the vehicle. And we'll also be able to show you what they're doing on their end as well. Okay, so we can see now that they've started an order. They are connecting to the vehicle and reading the information. So if we go and check out the VCI now, uh, we need to make sure the ignition's on and the ignition is on and we can see now that they are connected to that VCI. Okay, so it's just going through all its checks, linking it up, we are connecting. Okay, so we can see that Think Car UK are connected to the uh, car now. Um, what they'll be able to do is um, activate any of the things on the vehicle. And that's just to demonstrate the ability to um, connect to the car. Of course, what they can do is program the car, do any coding, they can do anti-theft uh, initializations, uh, calibrating components, even diagnosis. So they can help you with diagnosis and see all of the live data via the manufacturing tool from their end. Okay, so we can see that they've activated the washers now using the ODIS tool at their end. Um, what are they going to activate next? Okay, that was pretty loud. <laughs> That's the horn going there. So they've just done that basically through the internet, okay? Not through like... Um, Sometimes you can get some remote support things where they connect into your tool. Um, they're not connected to our tool at the minute, they're connected to our car through the internet. It's gonna be a really useful feature, especially for those people who haven't got all of the manufacturer's tools. You can actually just set up a ticket on here and let someone else do it for you who has those uh, subscriptions and access.